takes more than a great education at the Denver School of the Arts to make it on Broadway. It also takes luck, drive, and determination. Our critical arts, Greg Moody, found an example in the cast of An American in Paris. The dream is to perform. The reality is that's a tough road, even when you graduate from a place as special as the Denver School of the Arts. I knew I wanted to be a dancer. I was a dance major in high school, and I figured I would just be a professional right away, but my parents thought college would be a better transition. So I attended the University of Arizona in Tucson as a dance major and toured with a small company called Bad Boys of Dance around Europe after that, moved to New York, and um, I suppose just kept plugging away. Until Barton Cowperthwaite knew he wanted to dance to perform, but it took years of hard work and a singular vision to make it into the cast of An American in Paris. I lived in New York for just close to three years before I landed this, and I was doing a lot of different odd jobs, and uh, thankfully all in the arts, I've been very, very fortunate. It took luck, continual training, hard work, and a determination to persevere that brought Barton to the Broadway stage, but it also took an artist's driving need to simply create. It's fantastic. Luck kind of only scratches the surface. It's rare in musical theater that you think that you'll get to put all of the tools that you've trained to create to use. And this is the epitome of what a dancer should and, and could be doing on Broadway. And to do it in a show like An American in Paris, well, that's just the capper. Rich, musical, and filled with marvelous dance. I'm critic at large, Craig Moody for CBS 4 News. I'm sold. Yeah, American, it looks great. An American in Paris is at the Buell Theater March 8th through the 19th only. For tickets, visit our website, cbsdenver.com.